Hey everyone, today I want to talk to you about a software called DVD Shrink. And uh, this software, this program, is probably one of the best DVD decryption softwares I've used. And it's, uh, it's a pretty old program, it's been out for a few years, and it actually got discontinued. I'm not sure if it was for monetary reasons or the government had something to do with it but this program was very 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 popular so probably the government had to do something with its uh, discontinuance but this is DVD shrink 3.2 and after you download the setup file this is what it's gonna look like you got the D and the S if you're running Windows XP you're not gonna see this shield here no bother you know you're still gonna see this icon that's the icon you wanna click on if you do see this shield that means that you're running Windows Vista or Windows 7 just come down here after you right click run as administrator click yes and um it's just a very unique piece of software it has many nice features so let's get into it all right here's DVD shrink and first thing you're gonna wanna do is click on open disk this will come up it already selected my movie I have airheads in if you haven't seen it it's a very good comedy but uh, check it out if you can alright you're probably gonna see a rectangle uh, dialog box pop up it's gonna have a sub picture or I'm sorry it's gonna have a picture and um, it's just gonna skim through it like really fast and um, let's see um, do I need four channel audio or two channel audio let's just for example go with two I don't need any sub pictures like uh, subtitles because I'm English I know English and I read and speak English so I don't need subtitles and I don't need Spanish or French but for those of you who do or would like so that's always available so once you hit on your DVD remote subtitles or different type of audios that'll no longer come up um, if you want the extras and stuff if you want to reauthor the whole DVD come to reauthor and main movie 1 hour 32 minutes and 8 seconds drag this over here boom if you just want the movie and only the movie there you have it there's the movie and only the movie if you want extras put that in there but uh, you can have the DVD menus you'll see what all that's about gives you a little play box here I won't play it because it probably blast your ears out but anyways there's DVD shrink let's say you're done here you just want this no menu just play back up and let's say hard disk folder and leave all this the way it is options if you mess around with the options here you can have ISO or whatever you want so create DVD TS audio TS and um, you can do it that way or if you do it the ISO obviously but enough of me rambling on you just press OK and uh, once you press OK that same box this one that came up in the beginning is gonna come up now rip through the whole movie real quick and um, as you can see it's got the decryption status you know the decryption code and um, 
basically, you know, hey, I figured you out, I already know how to manipulate you, boom. Depending on your computer, this could take a really long time or a really fast time, but I have a very high performance computer, so it's going to rip through it very quickly. If you want to save a couple of frames, I always found it beneficial to disable the video preview, and then that way it doesn't have to render this as well as rip through the movie. But, um, that's DVD Shrink for you. If you like this video or thought it was helpful, thumbs up and subscribe for more cool videos. Thank you.